All right, guys, welcome to Lao. We're here in a small town called Menghua. We just finished riding this bike about a thousand kilometers to get here, and we're about to hop on a boat with the bike and head over downriver to a place called Muang Noi. It costs two million to take this boat. Two million sounds like a big number, but it's actually closer to about a hundred dollars US. And uh, however many people get on the boat, that's how that is divided. We need more people to arrive. I just checked right now, there's about two people there, plus us. It's a bit expensive, so we need more people to arrive before we can go, or we're gonna be paying quite a lot. Okay. No money, no money, no, no, no money. All, 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 all travel, okay. All travel. okay. <laughs> so right now we've negotiated from two million to 350,000 per person. It's just a bit less than $20. All right, guys, here we go. Okay. No seats, huh? All right. Made it on the boat. Goodbye, Mong Kwao. Next stop, where are we going? Huh? Mong Noi. Got some fellow travelers on this journey. What were your names, sorry? Bruno. Bruno? Yes. Bruno and? Kiros. 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 Where are you from, Bruno? France. France and Japan. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> So part of the agreement for us to get this price and to be able to go today is for us to change boats. So that's what we're gonna do right now, which means we have to transfer the bike again. Change boat. So by D. สบายดีสบายดีสบายดีเอ่อเอาเอาเอาทรายไปคุณนึงเอาเปลี่ยนเฮือนี้เค้าอันนี้ไปเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋
Where are you from? Mong Quang. Mong Quang. Where you go, Mong Noi? Okay. Vietnam? In Vietnam there? Oh, Vietnam. Vietnam. Wow. Okay. How many kilometer? Two kilometer. Vietnam. Yeah, Vietnam. Also a motorbike, eh? Come jai, bye bye. Come jai, jai. There goes our trusted boatman. Just when we thought we were off the boat, they're pulling us back in. Third time, third time getting on this boat now. Hey, okay for you. <laughs> I know, what the hell? We have to go down this. <laughs> Bringing the bike on the boat, they said. No problem, they said. <sighs> this is crazy. Three boat transfers in three hours. Almost there.
We're almost there. Hopefully this is the last time we're putting this thing on a boat. <laughs> and, and to go to Nankyo? Nankyo? I think there's a road. I hope there's a road. You think it's a road from uh, Nankyo? Yeah, I think so. I think no. so. No I think I think no more boats. I hope that's it. I hope there's no more boats. Anyways, Mong Noi, here we are. guys well here we are Mon Noi made it with the bike three boat transfers absolute pain in the ass total shit show but an adventure and definitely something we'll remember so now we're here in Mong Noi beautiful little village here on the river very much isolated from the rest of the main part of Lao because you can really only access it by river let me show you where we're staying so here, we've got our standard little bungalow. Very, very basic. Honestly, as much as I like comfort as I get older, I undeniably like staying in one of these every now and then. I feel like it reminds you that you're in Southeast Asia, and if you're too comfortable in this part of the world, you're kind of, you're not getting out of your comfort zone. Well, it's as simple as that. Mosquito net, soft bed, fan, light bulb, and there's Wi-Fi, so all that we need for our stay here in Mong Noi. The main reason why we picked this, for the view. We are paying 150,000 kip to stay here. I think that's about 8.50 or $9, so good value. All right guys, so we made it to Mong Noi. Been a hell of a day. Had to get a cold beer to, uh, yeah, celebrate an epic journey. The motorbike is alive, it runs, it's uh, an adventure, you know, you can't really predict when these things are gonna happen, but now we're gonna enjoy a nice lunch here in this lovely town of Monoy in Lao. Job well done today, guys. Thank you for your help, huh? <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Merci and uh, arigato. That's right, arigato, arigato. This is, this is why you need to have nice travelers on your boat when you go do this crazy shit, so that way you can at least actually get the bike out of the boat. All right, guys. Well, I think that's pretty much it for this adventure. Been a nice, fun day. A lot of excitement on the boat, especially with the bike. But we made it here in one piece, and yeah, that's the important thing. It's all part of the adventure at the end of the day. Uh, I think we're gonna have an interesting journey getting out of here. We were told that we have to go by boat. Someone said we have to go, we can go by land. Apparently the river is supposed to be too high for our bike, but we're not gonna listen to that local knowledge. We're gonna probably test it and see if we can make it through. We'll see how that goes. Anyways, it's been a real one. See you in the next adventure. Oh yeah, and please be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and press the buttons down here. Cheers, see you in the next one.